so you pitiful earthlings who want to look like me. Queen of Luna, will allow me to show you the face I show to the world, and my true self. Really, it would be much simpler to simply push you into the fire. But you earthlings are so sensitive about such things. You will begin by covering one eyebrow, as this earthling has done using the glue stick method, of which there are various tutorials. Then you will take a bit of cotton and apply it over your eyelashes and stick it down using a bit of skin tape. Then you will apply even more cotton over the top and stick that down with some liquid latex. Then you will apply various layers of liquid latex over the edges and covering all of the cotton. Then you will take a bit of torn tissue, and it must be torn because we do want this to look like torn, scarred flesh after all. And then you will apply that down with some liquid latex as well. Then applying the liquid latex in a linear fashion, we will take the cotton, thread it into a long strand, and apply that over the top. And repeat this process in various areas over your face. And then cover them with the liquid latex. Once you've applied enough layers, go over the top of all of it using a full coverage foundation or concealer. And then, once you've completed that, just go ahead and cover the rest of your face because we need to be all matchy-matchy. Then, very carefully, or not, honestly, your pain amuses me. You shall begin to tear holes in the liquid latex, and this shall create the appearance of sores. What would traumatic scarring be without a few open wounds? Then, taking some red cream eyeshadow, you shall go over the inside of those wounds to create a bit of a bloody appearance. Then, taking a warm light brown eyeshadow, just begin shading various ridges in the scarring to give it some depth. Then you will take a brown eyeshadow and just go over some of those spots for darker shadows. Then you will take a bit of black eyeshadow and create a line over the eye. After all, my eye is swollen shut and it must look like an eye. You will also use that black to shade in where we put the red cream base paint as well as go over some of those ridges to further create depth. Then taking a larger brush and some red eyeshadow, go over the entire thing so that it looks burned and irritated. Are you sure that I can't just push them into the fire? No, you can't push them into the fire. Well, fine then. Go back over everything with a bit of black eyeshadow over your skin, over the latex, to create some charred flesh because I would know that's what happens when you get your face burned. Then you shall begin the side with the glamour. Apply some concealer and set it with a translucent powder under the eyes. 
because you are trying to look like a queen and a queen does not walk around with dark circles and the bags under her eyes. Then as this earthling has done, you shall start on your eyebrows and give yourself a very sharp clean shape because when you are a queen, everything about you is precision. Next, you shall contour your face and give yourself the appearance of high cheekbones. I can accomplish this using a glamour, but you poor earthlings need a little extra help. Then you shall go over with a bronzer along your cheekbones and forehead to give it a little bit of a glow. And next, because you are not Luna and you are trying to look Luna, you shall apply highlighter to your cheekbones, above your eyebrows, along your nose, above your lip line, and along your chin, and basically anywhere that you need a little extra lunar help. Then you will apply an eyeshadow primer to your eyelids, and go over the top with a nude eyeshadow that matches your skin tone. Then, taking a warm brown eyeshadow, you shall apply that to your crease and outer corner of your eye. Then, taking a chocolate eyeshadow, you shall also apply that to the outer corner of your eye and then blend, blend, blend so it looks nice and soft and smoky. Then you will apply some liquid black eyeliner and make a wing sharp enough to cut Cinder down where she stands. Then, as always, you shall curl your lashes and apply some mascara. Blah, blah, blah. Then, taking a brown based red lipstick, you shall apply that to half of your lips. And voila! I hope you poor earthlings enjoy looking at me, because you will never be me.